Hi, I'm Zuzka Light and today I'm going to show you three different exercises that you might be doing wrong and tips on how to fix them. Squats. Many women do the mistake of going only halfway down in a squat. They stop the movement when their thighs are parallel to the ground instead of going through the full range of motion because they believe that full squats would hurt their knees. But the opposite is actually true because partial squatting puts too much strain on the kneecap and all the tendons and ligaments that surround your knee, which can create all kinds of overuse injuries. So stop doing wimpy squats and start bringing your hips down below your knees. Full squats are gonna activate your glutes and hamstrings and women should always focus on building strong glutes because that's for us literally the base for well-balanced physique. Lunges The most common mistake women make when it comes to lunges is that they take tiny baby steps out of fear that larger steps would hurt them. This is the same mistake as doing partial squats because these wimpy lunges put too much pressure on the front knee and make the tendons around the kneecap vulnerable to injury. So don't be afraid to take large steps whether you're lunging forward or backwards. And let me tell you a little secret. If you lean your upper body forward while keeping your back straight, it's gonna be way more gentle onto your knees and you're gonna be really strengthening your glutes because this variation of lunge really activates all of the muscles in the back of your legs. Jump rope. I have seen women jump rope way too high than necessary causing themselves painful shin splints and they also tend to use their entire arms to spin the rope which puts their shoulders in a high risk of injury. And besides that, it really doesn't look good and makes you look as graceful as a dinosaur. To fix that, try to always focus on keeping your elbows close to your body and use only your wrist to spin the rope. Relax your shoulders and keep your hands in between your hip and your waist level. Before you advance into any difficult jump roping techniques, start with the basic bounce and learn how to jump only a couple inches off the ground just to give the jump rope enough room to pass through. So I hope this video helps and if you want to get into the best shape of your life then come to my website zuskalai.com and sign up to my Z gym and work out with me on a daily basis. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video, leave me a comment below if you have any questions and subscribe to my YouTube channel so that you don't miss any new videos. And I will see you guys soon. Ciao! Hi Warriors! Welcome to my new online Z gym. We're doing workouts that will get you into shape at home within 15 minutes.